because I already know what's going to happen. I'm going to speak life into it. Check this out. All these trucks here, I'm going to be cleaning. Every single one of them here, I'm going to take over this location. What's up, my mobile detailing people? Welcome back again to part two of U-Haul, you guys. We back again. They love to work. This was yesterday when we did the truck. And now today we're back for the cargo van, you guys. I didn't think that they were going to call me back this fast for more work. But a random guy came up to me that I haven't met. And he was like, hey, man, um, whatever you did to that truck, we had to call you back again to do it again. So they said they're going to keep me busy here at U-Haul. And I'm hoping to take over this location here. And from this location, spread my name to the next one, to the next one, to the next one. And by then, man, we're going to have to get a whole nother fleet of uh, detailing vans to take care of you all, man. So that's the goal. Just get in here and do your job. Put God first and the blessings are going to come, man. Cargo van, part two. Let's make it do what it do. Let's go, y'all. Uh, are you charging it the same? More um, or less? You know what, to be honest, the condition of this one is pretty much the same. I think I'm going to keep it 250. Um, based on the condition, of course. So I want them to know that everything that I do is gonna be 250. And if the condition is worse, we'll take it higher. But you guys tell me what you guys think this one should be charged. All right, well, let me ask you. So last time we did a truck, today we're doing a van? Yep, yeah. yesterday was a truck, today's the cargo van right here. Let, let me ask you, what's the difference with washing a truck and a car, cargo van? Which one's more work? And which was, you know, the, which one takes longer? Uh, the cargo van, of course, it got, man, that's a, that's a good question. Well, I mean, the cargo van could be more simple. I guess it's all on how they took care of it because all I got to do is pressure wash the whole back end and um, scrub it maybe. But I would say the cargo van is bigger, but then again, the truck could be dirtier. Mm -hmm. So it, I guess it all depends on the condition, really, brother. So you're going to do the outside, regular. Right. But the inside, are you gonna do front and back? There it is right there, it's the front and back. But then again, the truck has a front and back also. I gotta wash the bed, scrub it if I need to. So I mean, mm. it can be the same, but the outside is bigger. So that, that'd take longer. And you're by yourself today, man. And I'm by myself, man. My brother, that 2K came out. So for all the people that got women, girlfriends, and y'all don't be abandoning y'all relationships for these games now. I know it gets real. But uh, get to work, man. Hey, Wayne. What's up? When you gonna hire an employee, man? I feel like you need one bad already. You know what, after winter. After winter? Winter time, I'm gonna have a lot of time to really uh, pick up the where I'm slacking at. You know what I mean? Writing stuff up, uh, contracts, and you know, I wanna have everything in line when I bring somebody on. So winter time is, you know, be All the right. time. So summertime, y'all be on the lookout, man, for a, for a job, man. How's it going, man? You uh, all right? I'm all right, but like I said before, this is heavy. What do so you mean this is heavy? Like this is physically heavy or? It's, it's physically heavy. Like it's a lot of pounds and I can't lift it up to clean it how I want. If you get what I'm saying, like look how dirty the bottom is. Yeah. And I put it back on there, it's gonna get back dirty. If you get what I'm saying. Yeah, hey, I can help you out, boy. So it's like, uh, need to figure out. There's, there's nothing I can do about that. You feel what I'm saying? It's just gonna have to be like that. There we go. I would have rinsed, ooh, I would have rinsed it out before I put it back in. Yeah. But then the bottom would have got wet. Mm. And it may be the wrong way. Or is it? Or is it? It looks right to me. No, we not. It, it is. is. It is? Yeah. Because look, this is big enough for the door right here. All right, let's get it.
So, what do you think of the cargo van? Was it a lot of work or kind of the same as any other job? It's the same. This ain't even dirty. But the fact that I treat everything the same, it really, it really wouldn't have mattered if it was extremely dirty or not. It's, everything gets treated the same, man. Got you. Rez knows that, Rez. You, you come and be like, oh, this is going to be easy. And then we'll be like two, three hours later, like. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think them as U-Haul people are going to come in here and be like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But me as a detailer, I'm not used to just, you know, I'm not used to large fleets. Like if they were to offer me all this here, like it'd probably take me a long time. I'm not used to speed like that. I like to get everything, you know? Mm. If I set out a whole day, then I, I, I know I can knock out like five. If I come at like six in the morning or eight, Dang. just do them all day. That's a lot. So I'm gonna ask them, what kind of details do y'all want? Do y'all want me to be here all day? Or do y'all want me to be in and out and it still be nice? You know what I mean? Mm. So I would ask them, well, you can go ahead and leave the tire shine off. You don't have to shine the inside. Uh, don't focus too much on all the vents. Just quick wipe down. And if they tell me that, then cool. I feel a lot better. Well, let me ask you. They do tell you, hey, you're doing too much. Mm -hmm. Keep it more simple. Yeah. But we want to pay a little bit less. What would you do? What would you say? You Sheesh. Would you work out a deal? Or be like, nah. well, That's a hard question because yeah. I, my first thing that comes in my head is I'm a detailer, like that's, I'm detailed. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? That would be hard. I guess I'll, I'll give it a try though. Like, okay, y'all want to give me half of 250? I'll do a 150 and I'll spray the, uh, the pressure washer, no foam cannon, get the buckets and just wash it real quick, rinse it, mm. let it air dry or something. Go inside, you know what I mean? Instead of doing all that. I mean, there's a lot of quicker ways that you can go about it. They don't care about no water spots. If the audience wants to know if u is gonna continue working with you, mm -hmm. what should they do, Wayne? Well, they should uh, subscribe and stay tuned, for yeah. sure. You know what I mean? If y'all liking the, uh, the growth, if you guys wanna see a young man go to the top and you want to implement the same thing, same energy, and, and make it happen too? Subscribe to this channel and let's make it do what it do. Come on, y'all, let's go. <laughs>